Hello everyone, what about this beautiful home right here? This is super sweet y'all. Man, I just went inside for the very first time for just a quick look, just a quick peek. And yeah, the exterior is definitely a 10. The interior, let me tell you what it is, 10.23. Okay, it's a 10. It's a 10, it's a 10 on the exterior and the interior. We're at Recreational Resort Cottages and Cabins. Super thankful they allowed me to come to their location and tour some of their homes. They actually have a few different locations. You can check them out online. Uh, I'll try to have some information in the description for you as well. And this house right here is just one of the many great homes they have. They have tiny houses. I'll give you a look at that one. They have a lot of tiny houses. They have, you know, your typical manufactured home. They have little cottages. They have uh, even some multi-section houses. So a lot of different homes that you can see here. So if you're over this way, you need to check them out. We're gonna to be touring this right here. This one is actually manufactured by Athens Park. And I, I've done these in the past and I recognize a lot of the similarities. I know the traffic's crazy, but I've gotta give you a good look out here. I'll try to be as brief as I can. But yeah, I remember this siding. Now obviously the one that I, the last one I toured didn't have an outside fireplace like this one. Full glass door here. Check this out. I mean, does it really get any better than that? I'm asking, seriously, drop a comment, I need to know. <laughs> All right. So, let me take you inside. We got outside plug there. Y'all stay tuned at the end. I'll try to provide some information for you. Let's go ahead and make our way in. I'll encourage you to drop a like if you will, and don't forget to subscribe if you enjoy these types of tours. Here we go. Okay. So not only is the exterior of this tiny house really cool. It has an interior layout um, like I've never seen in a tiny house. So I thought that was another reason. There's so many homes here. I was like, I don't know which one's a tour, you know, because there's so many that I would love to showcase and I can't spend a whole week out here, even though I probably could and it would be well worth my time. <laughs> uh, so I'm trying to hit some of my favorites and uh, yeah, y'all come check them out. If you're over this way, there's a lot of other houses. Look, look, look. So yeah, we got the uh, blinds in the door there. I know you've seen that probably. Huge ceilings with the windows up top. Looks like we got Whirlpool appliances. Got a nice window right there. Could you imagine if you got uh, something going on out there. You got this window where you could see what's going on, you know, or if you need to raise the window. How you like your eggs? I mean, maybe, maybe, uh, maybe your spouse, your husband's out there drinking coffee in the morning and you're cooking him breakfast as any wonderful wife probably does for their husband. And you know, and I mean, I would think you would know how he'd like his eggs, but maybe he wants to switch it up. You know, might need to ask him. Try to get a little bit of lighting on for y'all. There we go. So you've got you a nice little sitting area here. And another thing that I remember seeing in that other home that I did that was Athens Park, they had one of them islands that you could like move around. That'd be very nice in here, I think, as well. What y'all think? We have the stairs going up to the loft. We will, I'll take y'all up there. I wanna look at everything here on this main level first. I love this one has the Western vibes. I mean, I'm seeing saddles and stuff all over the place. Here's where you're gonna have your stackable 
washer and dryer. We've got us a nice pocket door into the bath. And I ain't never seen a horse with boots on. Look at that. Goodness gracious. Looks like we've got us a medicine cabinet behind here. Yes, we do. Like that backsplash we see. Now, we've got our shower here. You notice if you walk in, it raises up a little bit for those of you fellas that are a little taller like myself. You could probably option in maybe a towel shower in there. I would think. All right, let me give you one look in a cabinet. I hadn't, I hadn't even shown y'all a cabinet in this whole house. Y'all want me to go in there and show one in the... I, I ain't gonna do it now, but uh, I'll tell you what. Let's go into the bedroom next. Oh, wow. I hadn't been in here. When I came in, I just kind of peeked around it, and this door was shut, so I didn't even go in here. We got us a mini split in here, a couple windows. We've got this beautiful trim that you're gonna see throughout the house. We got these barn doors that slide shut. Your closets, you're gonna have two closets, one on each side, and then you can slide them this way. But when you got them slid over this way, you got a spot for a TV here with some drawers. Let's open a drawer. I like you have the black pulls. You got the black hardware on your, on your uh, doors here. Everything really matches and goes together very well. Breaker box. Let's see what we got upstairs. What do you say? Let's go. What's great is I can actually walk up here and not have to be like crunched down. Now, obviously, when I get up here, I'm going to have to bend down a little bit, but wow. What I do like, and I've talked about it before in some tiny homes, is, you know, individual like me can come sit right here on top of these stairs and you can talk to the kids, play with the kids. I could easily, you know, be sitting down in there as well. You got a little bit of a vault right there in the middle. It's gonna be a little bit higher and you got windows on each side. All right, I'm gonna gather some information to share with you on this house, so y'all stay tuned for that. And uh, don't forget to share if you haven't. Please, if you know somebody out this way looking for a home, and subscribe to the notification bell. Well, let's get into a little bit of info on this particular tiny house. And I gotta start out by saying, once again, a huge shout out to Recreational Resort Cottages and Cabins there in Rockwall for letting me come and tour some of their amazing homes. I've toured several of them. They're already on the channel if you wanna check them out. And like I said, I even toured a multi-section house they have here. There, it's called Sequoia. I'm gonna drop their link in the description. You can check it out if you wanna see there, or you can check it out on the on the channel as well. And then I, I did, I didn't really get a good shot, but that tiny house to the left, pop up the thumbnail right here, I toured that house and it's done really well on here. People, people have definitely loved that house and Here's another one that we done. And for me, I guess what captivated me into wanting to do this one, since they had, like I said, like I said, they have so many models, was that outside fireplace. Plus you have a loft and everything. I love like the really tall ceilings in your living room, kitchen area. But that was a deciding factor for me, but you can check them out online. Link will be in the description if you'll see all of the houses they have there. This home is manufactured by Athens Park and they're built out of Athens, Texas. And so, yeah, we're looking at um, going to be considered a tiny house, 399 square foot, going to be built to the ANSI 119 code. So with that being said, these homes can be shipped um, a lot of different places. Now, one thing that they had told me while I was there is they're going to service their area. You know, obviously each uh, retailer dealership is going to kind of cover their 
region or whatever where they can ship these houses, set them up and everything like that for you. But then some of these smaller type homes, they can even ship them out, you know, way off to other states and stuff. Now, obviously when these homes get to where you're at, uh, let's just put it in perspective. Say you're in Nevada. What's the weather like over there? Anyway, say you're there. Say you purchase this house, they could have this house transported to you. Now, once it gets out there to where you're at, you're gonna have to be responsible for getting it set up and all that type of stuff. But that is an option with these smaller type homes, which you typically won't see with retailers that mostly that I go to most of the time, they're gonna cover, say if they're in Texas, they're gonna kinda cover the Texas area and that's kinda all they're gonna be able to cover. You're going to find that same model or manufacturer at another location closer to you. But with this, a little bit different. Hope that makes sense. Y'all drop a comment if you have a question. I'll try to answer if I see it. And then if, if you do see somebody comment and you know the answer, y'all go ahead and help them out there. Appreciate Appreciate you. All right. Uh, so, yeah, the videos come out on here Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday night. And I know I, I didn't really know about putting this house out tonight because the previous video was like almost 3,200 square foot. So, this is a totally different type house. But that's kind of what I like to do here on this channel. I want to show you off a little bit of everything in the manufacturing and modular home industry. And so I thought this was a great option. Plus this is in Texas. Last time some videos in Alabama. So it kind of spreads out a little bit as well. But anyways, if you had seen some of those previous videos of some really, really big houses, you need to check them out. Plus check out our tiny house playlist. If you want to see more of the tiny houses that I've toured, I actually just did a Athens park not long ago at the Biloxi Manufacturing Home Show. Here's the thumbnail to it. It recently just came out on the channel probably two or three weeks ago. So you should check that one out if you have it. Okay. Also, last thing I'll mention about that is I just, I meant to talk about, so like you see the tile shower in that house. If you go back and watch that video, you look that beautiful big tile shower. That's, you know, something that you could option in on one of these, on like this model right here as well. So keep that in mind, keep that in mind, in mind. keep that in mind when it comes to the different options stuff on these houses. With that being said, that'll lead us into pricing, obviously. So all those options depend on the impact on pricing, the location, uh, you know, state, county fees, codes, all that kind of stuff. But they did provide me uh, pricing for at the time of recording. This will be uh, straight from recreational resort and cottages and cabins. Now, obviously, it's going to depend on a lot of different options. And like I said, it'll be at the time of recording. Here you go. Whew, that was a lot. Here you go. Okay. Let me know what you think. Be sure to watch another video if you're not half asleep yet. Wake up! It's not time to go to, what is it, like 1130 at night? Maybe you should call it. Maybe watch one more than call it, okay? Wait a minute, 12.42, you need to get off in the bed. <laughs> All right, I'll see y'all real soon. God bless you.